drying. Righty, magpie, hello, hello, croc, hello. We'll clear this drain. We'll go through here. Pull out the fog. Get a little test. blockage now my head is getting caught which isn't a good sign to check out what's going on there. So far so good, a little bit of dislocation there, pipe's coming apart, <sighs> what is that, that doesn't look good, is that another croc croc, I hope not. Yeah, me too. You know what that looks like? That there shouldn't be there. That looks like a plumber's eel. Yeah, it is. So the plumber, one year, one day, has gone down with his eel. He's got it stuck. He's gone, stuff this. We're getting out of here. And he's cut his losses and left his eel in there and done a runner so he's obviously got it stuck and it's been in there for a while by the look of it we have to try and get that out somehow looks like 
It looks like it's broken in there and it's wrapped around inside there. It's a bit hard to tell because there's a bit of water running at the moment. We managed to pop it so we can see what's going on. Now there is an IO on top of it, just there, and the inspection opening on top of the pipe, which we can get to hopefully by digging down, and then we can try and remove this eel and get an idea of the damage of the pipe, because uh, that's got to come out. So we'll go and we'll go and locate that. I reckon. Yeah, I reckon. Uh, Crocking might want to locate this one. Rigid. Croc marks the spot. Go on, Crocky. Do much of a mark, can we? That'll do, Croc. Croc marks a spot. Yeah. Nice one, Crocky. Well, I've got to dig down here and pull out that eel. out there crocky all right might get rid of some of this water the spot all right let's see how we can get this up you better get out of the way croc
pretty thick concrete.
What is this? What is this? Uh huh. I think we found a five. That would be great news. Look at that. There's an old IO. Uh huh. I'm still a long way from the actual problem. I found an old eel though. So we go in that way, probably about another seven meters. Oh boy. Right, there's our camera. Which we'll pull out and then have another look through. Okay. So there's the beginning. We'll start that at zero. We'll push in and see how far we get. Okay, so we are three meters, three meters in underneath the floor of this extension. And there's a break in there and that eel is stuck in there. I've got to get that eel out somehow. Which will mean a bit more banging. A bit more concrete banging. open up a can of worms mag file like that It's just a figure of speech, croc. Can of worms. It means there's a, a can of problems. Worms being the problems. Can you 
see it? There's the eel. I'm gonna try and pull it out. Well, we don't use eels anymore. Maybe, maybe a car jack will get it out. You know, jack it out. That might be a go. We'll just have a look down there. any movement when I pull on it. Oh, look at that. You can see it's all curled up inside. I've got to try and pull that curl, that knot of spring out. Oh, 
so glad you could join us, Magpie and Ratty. Hawk's been doing all the work. Okay, so I've got the old jack from the car. I'm not familiar with these kind of jacks. Um, we'll see how we go with it. I think this one turns here. And then this does some sort of weird thing up here. It's not your average jack. See? See what I mean? It's not normal. But it might work. It might work. I need to get the eel into here and then just jimmy it up somehow. Okay? I've never done this before, so let's see. Write that down. Get this eel out somehow. I get the jack into there. Jack there. I don't know what to do. I guess we'll just spin. to tie that onto the screwdriver somehow. Okay, find something. Just might do the trick. Coat hanger. Under the coat hanger.
see how we're going. Oh boy, we're never going to pull that out, Oliver. Look at that. That is just curled up on itself in there. We we'll never ever pull that out. Huh. That is ridiculous. No wonder they ran away. I would have as well. But that's underneath the house running everywhere. Ugh. Six meters that way. This looks like the boundary track. This is where it's going to go, boundary shaft. It's going to come to here, drop down into there. Right, looking at this, I wonder if I can get down inside here. Maybe look under the house, see if we can find it under there. Put it onto low coat. Crock and lots of spot. Let's go hunting. Crocky. Polsky.
Divert the whole pipe. Doesn't look too healthy. Old crossword. Oh. Old fridge. Okay. So that's not good. Not good at all. There's a big sinkhole underneath the building. 
there's a coiled up eel Go back there. Just take a quick photo of the damage. This is, I'm guessing this is the boundary shaft. We'll see what sort of state it's in. No my luck. It's full of roots that needs to be cleared. at the bottom. More roots. Oh boy. Alright, so I need to clear that out. Give it a little test. Works, works. Very good. See if it sticks. Yeah, she sticks. Try a different head. Cut out those roots.
get stuck. I got it. Well, obviously there's big problems down there. <sighs> so, what needs to be done We need to continue this pipe here, along here, watch the land mine, along the land mine, we need to bring it down here, connect it into the shaft and then it's working because six meters under here as we know sinkhole, massive uh, eel stuck in there, all curled up underneath the uh, building. <sighs> Million dollar question, all good, all bad, all good, all bad, all bad, all bad, all good. All good.